Hello everyone and welcome to day number 3 of the LEGO Star Wars Advent Calendar unboxing. Now yesterday we received Sabine Wren and you guys, quite overwhelmingly so, voted for her to go in the awesome pile. So therefore I have placed her in said awesome pile. But I haven't just put her in said awesome pile. I need to stop speaking like that. <laughs> I haven't just placed her in the awesome pile. I have placed her on top of the ghost, making it look like she's skateboarding on the ghost because, quite frankly, I have too much time on my hands. So yeah, she's been cutting about, you know, just doing what people do on skateboards, flips, and yeah, that's her dead. Okay, we've just killed off a character. Feels like Game of Thrones a bit, doesn't it? But uh, regardless, I'm just gonna shimmy you over here. Uh, we're gonna open box number three, which I said I would sort this out yesterday, yesterday but uh, I didn't. Box number three is still off camera. And good job it is off camera. I've just ripped a mass. Oh, papers come off and everything. Uh, ooh, that's gonna be sore in the morning. Right, let's um, pull out a piece of plastic and uh, show you my delightful wares. Um, we have white pieces. Have you, you, you noticed a pattern? A lot of white. A lot of white from my advent calendar this year. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to build on camera again because people seem to like that. People say yes to building on camera. So what you're going to see here is um, probably what will turn out to be 10 minutes cut down to 30 seconds because you'll just see me failing at building this. But uh, yeah, I'll see you very soon. And we are back. Now you might have noticed a little jump cut there because I had to quickly Double check on Google if this was the ship I was thinking it was because I wasn't about to sit here and be like, oh yeah, look at this ship, it's really cool. And then in the comments you're like, that's, that, you no, you, you've definitely got that wrong. Yep. <laughs> so, yeah, I had to double check. And I'm, you know, I'm still not completely sure, but because we're going with a theme of Star Wars Rebels as a fleet, I'm guessing that this is the Phantom, which is the little ship that basically the the rebels use on sort of sort of smaller missions as opposed to the ghost so for example um it usually sits you know around the sort of back of the ghost and yeah it's clearly not a scale because we're both mini ships but i believe that's what is the phantom maybe hopefully regardless i'm not that impressed with it now you'd have probably seen in the build I messed up building it a few times, uh, which wasn't good. Uh, yeah, well, what are you going to do? I felt a bit of pressure actually. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It's just a bit blocky at the back. You know what I mean? It's it's not it's not screaming at me. It's not like oh, you know, it's oh yes. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what those noises were, but I'm not blown away by it. So if I was calling it myself, which I'm not, I would probably put it in the the meh, the, the meh pill, the meh, you know, uh, but it's not up to me, of course, it's up to you lovely people at home, I know you're lovely because I'm not going down that route, that's, uh, yeah, I can probably get done for stalking, but regardless, <laughs> you you have the power to vote, um, and the card poll on screen now is this, well, it is at the Phantom, first of all, I think it is, but uh, is, is it good, is it awesome, worthy, is it meh worthy or is it the awful pale so far we've only had the the awesome pale in effect so will it change who knows i guess we'll just have to find out in tomorrow's episode but thank you guys for watching once more and yes as i said join me tomorrow for box number four what lies beyond box number four oh the excitement's killing me i need to have a lie down <laughs> yeah until late guys goodbye